I am Dr. Satish. I am a senior consultant surgeon in the Department of Minimal Access Surgery, Metabolic Surgery, and General Surgery at Columbia Asia Referral Hospital, Ashwantpur, Bangalore. An incisional hernia, very commonly, as the name indicates, occurs after a patient undergoes a laparotomy for any other procedure. And the most common symptom is a swelling in the anterior abdominal wall. They see a bulge. That is the most common presentation. Sometimes what happens is the patient will develop pain in association with this hernia. Now when the pain is there, it can be related to two reasons. One is the omentum, that is the fat being stuck in the incisional hernia or the intestines herniating out. When it is just the fat, the patient will experience only pain and there is no other bowel symptoms. Sometimes they might have a little bit of vomiting or fever. But when the intestines have herniated out, the patients will present with bowel obstruction features. They are unable to pass motions or flatters and they start vomiting. And there is abdominal distension. The other symptom that could be very commonly related to incisional hernias is just a sort of giving way when the patient coughs. In addition, the patient would also feel a sort of weakness and there would be also bowel obstruction symptoms occasionally even though there is no intestine that is herniated out. This happens when the omentum is herniating out and the bowel tends to entangle or go across the omentum that is herniated. 